There was an incident about two weeks ago in South Africa yeah. where a pilot who was flying an aircraft felt something very small getting through his back. And, back. He, and he later, to his uh, amazement, found out that it was a Cape Cobra, one of the deadliest snakes uh, to live around that region in Africa. So according, I mean, I want a perspective of an engineer who does look at checking before deeming whether an aircraft is uh, worth, worthy of flying. How might uh, an animal like that get yeah. into an aircraft? Are there certain spaces within an aircraft that might get unnoticed? Yeah, it might be because, you know, during, before the flight, uh, the engineer does not go through the whole the aircraft. He doesn't, he doesn't see, go through every component, every portion of the aircraft. He just goes through what are important, right? So he's given a checklist. He checks through the checklist. Might be that portion uh, might not have been pinpointed on the checklist, right? So might be the reason the area, the portion where the snake was hiding might not be in the checklist. That might be the reason. Because South Africa, you get variety, you have a variant varieties of snakes there, right? Anywhere it can hide anywhere, right? <laughs> yeah. 